Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2020 Panini Prism Football Mega Box Edition One Box Random Team Break Number Three with the final four football mixer spots being given away. That mixer is going to happen in uh, in a little bit later. In a little bit later. In a little bit later. Um, we're going to do the break itself first, then we'll re-randomize everyone's names with a new dice roll, and then we'll see who wins those spots. Big thanks to all of these folks here for getting into the action. There's all the teams there. Uh, we are Joey, absolutely. So buy your, buy your spots. Four and a two, six times for names and teams. One, two, three, four, five, and sixth and final time. After six, we've got Brian all the way down to Jack. Six times for the teams. One, two, three, four, five, and six. A lot of football news happening. Robert Sala, head coach of the Jets now. I think he took a, an assistant coach with him to be offensive coordinator. So the Jets looking forward to the offseason. And we got games this weekend. So NFL, that's, that's, that's the king of American sports, right? The NFL is pre pretty dominant dominating the sports news cycle. Big thanks to all of these people once again. There's the first half of the list. There's the second half of the list right here. No trade windows in these little filler breaks, so let's just print and rip. Anyone have any thoughts on this weekend's game? I'm sure we'll, we'll have plenty of time to talk about it tomorrow as well. But... Any thoughts on, on tomorrow's uh, or this weekend's games? Anyone see any upsets happening? Some people, we were talking a little earlier about some people think a Rams upset is, is definitely possible. I mean, I have financial interest in the, uh, in the Packers, but I'm kind of second-guessing myself. <laughs> My first thing, I think... Matt Arnold was saying earlier, go with your first instinct, Joe. So I, I think I'm sticking with my first instinct. I'm not going to hedge out of those those investments, but it's got me thinking. Maybe it'll just be closer. I don't know. That's what makes uh, playoff investing so uh, so scary. Vegas Vegas has the lines pretty sharp. I think at this point of the season, you know. A lot of, lot of the, the classic trends and whatever, all that stuff is out the window. A lot of pressure and a lot of, you know, fewer games. and We'll see. Brendan saying Tampa to beat the Saints. Ethan's real nervous. He just wants that. He's a, he's a Bills. He just wants that Bills-Ravens game just to be over with. I'm on the Bills. Laying a tiny point. Essentially a pick'em. I don't think I don't think games end in one point differences too often. But Ethan also can see the Rams winning. I don't know. Is it just because they looked that it looked good against Seattle? Or are we are we are we forgetting that Green Bay's at home? The thing with the Rams is that they're not they're not a sexy team. Right, especially offensively, but their their numbers, their metrics are just so, so good. Yeah, Narg doesn't see uh, Patrick Mahomes losing. I don't, I don't, I don't think I see that either. There's Meikle Hardman, Green Pulsar for the Chiefs. That will be for SV. There's Christian Fulton, Green Pulsar. Yeah, we can, J Dog. I think we have. We usually have sets of. We usually have sets of football card, football base cards that we have. And all the all the money goes to charity. 
So you can you can go through those. You can buy it, boxes of those. There's a Michael Ojemudia for Denver. That's going to be for Jack. No, no, no big quarterback rookie cards. No, nothing too crazy in here. But again, the whole point of this is to uh, is to try to win a mixer spots. So from Jack down to Jack and everybody in between. Let's put all that right there. It'll be the top four names after four. Two and a two, hard four. Top four after four. One, two, one, two. Now from five on down, my apologies. We'll get them next time. But congrats to the top four. You're in that football mixer coming up in a little bit. Jack, Mike, Brian, and Mike. There you go. Two out of the four spots, Mike. Nice. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Thanks for breaking with us. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.